Good morning, you two pie smokers. Well, you know me, always testing things out. So I was smoking my pipe this morning, which I cleaned last night. And I clean it with either uh, this stuff, Clean and Cure, or I have my own uh, alcohol I use. Anyway, uh, so I smoked the first bowl this morning of my Captain Black, and it was an excellent smoke this morning. And then I um, loaded up a second bowl, and it wasn't as good as the first bowl. So I said, hmm. That's interesting. So this is a 9mm Series 3 7LE filtered pipe. So I decided let me clean it and on the, with the second bowl, this is the pipe cleaner that went through the bowl. And this is the pipe cleaner that went through the stem. You can see some black. So in my opinion now, and it wasn't my opinion a month ago, is after you finish a pipe, run a pipe cleaner through. You could do it with one cleaner. Uh, I use two for purposes of seeing the difference between the stem and the bowl. And um, sacrifice one pipe cleaner, clean your pipe, and then before you load another bowl, I think you'll get a better taste of the tobacco and um, get rid of that harsh tar like substance and um you appreciate now the bowl tastes as good as my first one after cleaning the pipe so my opinion it pays to sacrifice a pipe cleaner i think this is where the non-filtered guys have an edge over us filtered guys is because they usually run a pipe cleaner through as they're smoking to absorb moisture so they're always clearing that passage um so maybe that's another reason why non-filtered pipe smokers uh, sometimes have a better experience, maybe. Uh, sometimes I think we get too complacent with the filter doing the work, and I still have to get rid of that harshness. That dirt creates a bitter f flavoring other than the tobacco. Anyway, hope that helps, and I'll catch you on the next one.